Go, go, go. Love that ability. Do do. All right. Make sure I watch for masks. Wait, this room doesn't match my blueprints. It must have been renovated recently. Give me a minute to figure this out. Oh, by Aladdin's beard. Do you not know that rule number 37 in the Thieves' Handbook is expect the unexpected, foresee the unforeseen, predict the unpredictable? Keep your turban on. My sonar readings show an old passageway through a cave system beneath the floor. Let's see. Massive payload, angle of incident, relative humidity divided by two. Got it. Delete. If we could drop that pallet of carpets in the corner, it should slash a hole in the floor straight through to the caverns below. We? It seems that I will be doing all the work. How about we just talk when you reach the passageway? <laughs> I do like Salim and Bentley's interactions, even though Salim is my least favorite of the Coopers. Like I said, just because Salim is my least favorite of the five doesn't mean I don't like Salim. I love Salim. I love all five. I just happen to like some more than others. Uh, I guess I just jump down over here and go around, yeah. Don't mind me, you stupid snakes. Snakes? Why did it have to be snakes? Stupid snakes. Thinking they can outrun Salim Al-Kupar. Let's try and keep an eye out for those masks I was talking about. Every mask I get now is one less mask I have to get in the post-game. Look at how good I am at this game. Holy cow. Salim Al-Kupar OP. had a magic lamp. I would wish for this job to be over. You wow. clearly... Those are some giant Diablo scorpions. Nasty. You probably just want to avoid them, but destroying those testing mouths will clear them out. Yeah. Keep moving forward and you should reach the base of the tower. I was going to say he clearly has a magic lamp because he uses it for his uh, stealth attack, but I guess it just doesn't have a genie. Ow. I do really like his sand attack. That's really cool. Uh, I guess I don't need to jump further down. I need to be going through here, probs. Don't mind if I do. All these roaches. Can I kill them? Apparently not. Well, okay then. They will continue to live another day. Oh, no. I just stuck my hand in... <laughs> <laughs> that sounds unfortunate. How many of these stupid sand dunes can there possibly be? We're not really sand dunes, they're rock dunes, I guess. Cut back on scorpion meat? But it tastes like chicken, Bentley, you don't understand. Chicken, man. It's a great food group. Pretty sure chicken is not its own food group, but whatever. Do you see all this crap going on? All right, believe you're in. Now you just have to make your way to the top of the tower. Of course, climbing, my favorite. I don't see an access point, but that lever looks worth investigating. And be careful not to stir up the scorpion nests in here. I was definitely planning on stirring them up, but I guess now I won't. I'll just destroy them instead. What the heck hit me there? Did one of the scorpions... That one I saw myself get hit by, but I think another scorpion, like, got beneath me somehow before that and hit me. It was weird. All right, cool. I don't see any masks, so I guess we're set to go. What do I do? Oh, I gotta hold it down? Okay. Oh, I get it. Right, right, right. We're going to pull this bad boy up so I can use it to launch myself upward. I don't know why this exists in this room, but whatever. Can I, uh, I can't spire jump on it. I can jump on this, though. There we go. Up, up, and away. All right. Is, is there something about a three-humped camel that makes it better than a single or a two-humped camel? 
Or is that just like a saying? Not playing your games today, you stupid. No, I pressed R2, but it didn't it didn't go. Dang it. Good thing that these things restock themselves. Easy. Man, I am good. I also remember a mask in here, and I know where it is. I didn't realize that it was this level that we were doing, but uh, I think it's right here. Yep, there it is. Got to get past all these fools. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, well. I knew as I was walking by, like, he's going to look up before I can get to the other side, and lo and behold, it happened. But, yeah, you got to get that mask without being detected. Stupid monkeys. I'm going to get that mask. It belongs to me. I mean, obviously it belongs to me. It looks like a Cooper thing. Like, I'm a Cooper. It's got to be mine. All right, so I think the way you're supposed to do this is hit that and then run over here. Oh, they actually didn't get alerted by that at all. Huh. How are you supposed to do this? Can you just go around the corner? Can you go around them? I don't remember how you do this. I remember this mask being here, but I don't remember how I got it. Can I just... Oh, I can't do it with a snake there. Is there a way to, like, fall from above? No? I don't remember how to get this, guys. I'm not gonna lie here. Oh, the snake... Okay, the snake hit him. But, uh, then I got caught. Wonder if that would have done me any good. And this has got... Oh, whoops. I thought that I was hitting an invisible wall at first, but then I realized I wasn't as they caught me. And then I did that. Okay. I'm getting this mask. Even if it kills me. How am I going to do this? It's in the light. So I have to, like, swing my cane, but I'm afraid I'm going to hit him. Nope. My cane is not getting it. I think I have to touch it. But it's in the light. Yep. Dang it. Also something in my throat. <coughs> ah. That was bad. How do I get this? I don't remember. Oh, whoops. <laughs> I thought that he was uh, not looking up, so I was just going to jump over and pass by him. I'm really sick of dying at this spot, by the way. Alright, let me figure out what's the best way I'm going to be able to do this. Aw, oh, dang it! I'm getting impatient now, and I'm just trying to blow past this, and that's not going to work. I can't do that, so I've got to I've got to stop being so impatient. Let's just wait a second. Be calm. Salim's only special ability is that he can do the uh, the boost thing that we did before. That's his only special ability. So, there has to be... If I break this, will I hear it? Yep. Can I kill you and no one notice? Aw, oh, dude, my lamp thing is a silent kill. I didn't know that. There we go. I didn't know that Salim's uh, stealth kill was silenced. I didn't think he'd have a silenced stealth kill along with the paraglider. I thought his only uh, bonus thing would be the paraglider. Or magic carpet, you know what I mean. But no, he's got a stealth kill. All right. All these blades and traps. Just what an old thief wants to see. Bum 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 ba dum. Oh no, I went the wrong way. I tried to go to the right instead of the left, and I realized too late that I was supposed to go to the left. There we go. I'm not sure what properties Salim possesses to make him do this whole leap thing, but it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool indeed. Am I gonna raise another thing here? Is that where I was before? Yeah, that's where I was before. I was about to say, this looked like it might have been a secret, but that's just the way I was before. I came up that way already. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, I'm sticking out the tongue of that thing. Never mind, I'm not raising another 
spire for myself. Oh no. Good thing I did that quickly. Stupid, I, dang it, I hate it when they do that. Sometimes the snakes just instantly come out before you can even try and press R2. It's really annoying because there's nothing you can do about it other than get hit. Go on, do your, yeah, there you go, okay. Why am I not, what the, why didn't I grab onto it? Game, you're, uh, you're starting to tick me off a little bit right now. Numerous things happening in a row that should not be occurring. Come on. Okay. Okay, grabbed it that time. That's, that's step one, is actually grabbing the thing I'm trying to grab. There we go. Am I at the top? I should be at the top now, or near it. Taking all this loot, because it belongs to me now. The end should be just up ahead, I think. Maybe. Perhaps. We'll see. Easy. There. Yeah, I am. Oh, no. A lot of lights. Not as... Not as few lights as I thought there were. There you go. Thought there was only one. Oh, did I make it? I really like these floor panels, by the way. The whole scorpion grabbing thing. Hope is lost. No, we just need to disable the device before freeing him. But we have to proceed carefully, or we risk turning his brain into jelly. What is this jelly? Oh, uh, mm. sort of like mm. Baba Ganoush or hummus, mm. but fruity. Mm. Exactly. Just give me a closer look at that thing so I can turn <laughs> it off. All right, let's do it. But first, we look around for potential masks. Also, open up the mini-map, because that's a thing I need to do. I gotta remember that. There's an achievement for opening the map in every single location. Now, I'm gonna have to go back and open a lot of, uh, redo a lot of jobs and just open the map and it then leave. I'll do most of that off-screen, because that's honestly just a big hassle. Uh, okay then, I don't see anything. Let's hack! I think what we're going to do is the mission ends after this hack. So after this hack, we're going to get the last of the bottles, get this last safe, and try and get some treasure hunting going on with Salim. And also, we're doing my least favorite hack in this game. Oh, no. It's like a pinball machine. Don't worry, Bentley. We've got this. Easy peasy. Probably should have tried to grab that time thing, but whatever. Oh, no. I didn't realize whoa, whoa, that those were what they were. I am running out of time, and this is being fancy. I need more than two seconds per thingamajig. Oh, do I have to fall down this? I gotta fall down it. Make it in! Get in, get in, get in! Oh my goodness, one second. I think that's the closest I've ever come on one of these levels. Just barely made it. But cool, we should be done with this uh, level now, which means we're about to be doing a lot of collecting for the last video of this part. Last video of this session, I mean. Last part of this session, you know what I mean. My brother, are you alright? Oh, oh, my head. Where am I? You have been imprisoned, hypnotized, and compelled to create forgeries by that evil elephant. But I have freed you from her mesmerizing music with, you know, some assistance. That's nice. I'm hungry. Did you bring me anything to eat? Perhaps some nice roasted scorpion tails? Maybe some camel milk? Amazing! I climb halfway to the stars to rescue you, and you expect camel milk? Why do I bother? <laughs> uh, poor Salim, having to deal with these douchers. Anyways, yeah, we're going to be doing some treasure and trophy hunting. Well, not trophy hunting. I said trophy hunting because I read the word trophy. Uh, treasure and bottle hunting is what I meant to say. 
Because we've only got like four or five more bottles, and with Salim's uh, his climb ability unlocked now, we should be able to do it pretty easily.